Aloha kako. Ohayo gozaimasu. It's so wonderful to see all of you today. How are you feeling today? Well, that's good. That's good. Oh, children, that's probably Barkley the dog. Let's go see. Okay, so who we? Who's that? It's Barkley the dog. Ruff! Yee-ha! Aloha, kaka, hiaka! Ohio gazimas! Good morning, kids! It's me, Barkley the dog, coming at ya! Well, good morning to you too, Barkley. You're looking well. Thank you, Sensei. I feel good. I look good. I am good. But not so much. Ha <laughs> ha! Okay, let's see, where are we? Would you like to put the magic glasses on and see who's here with us this morning? Well, yee my halo sensei, I'm much obliged. I've always wanted to use the magic glasses and see who's here. Okay, so let's go. Let's see, let me put on my magic glasses here and say, okay, ha, oh, look, I can see Kalena and Tyrus and Tori and Benji, and look, there's Cora and Nolan and Meliana and Lilinoi. And look, there's Maddie. Hi, Maddie. And Lena and Kavet and Micah and Emmy and Kaya and Wesley and Sierra and Lindsay and Kenneth. And I see Melody and Cadence too. Hello. And oh, look, there's Jai and Ison, Cruz and Tide. And so many other wonderful children from around the world. Yee Hello, children. And I can also see our, our Dharma school teachers, Auntie Sharon and Auntie Karen. Thank you all so much for joining us this morning. Whoops, I think since I jumped ahead too fast, but that's okay. Well, Sensei, that's a good thing that you jumped fast because today's speaker is Reverend Tommy from Puna Honganji. And so I think, uh, I think I better shut up here and let's just get to the story. Okay, well, that's a wonderful segue to the next sequence. Hoo wee, Sensei, segue, using them big fancy words again. Why don't you just say, let's read the story now? Okay, well, let's do that. Let's read the story now. Okay, and here we go. And it's a good thing because today's story is Mindful Monkey, Happy Panda. Story by Lauren Alderfer and illustrations by Carrie Lee McLean. One late afternoon, as Monkey was walking home from a long day at school, Monkey came across Panda, sitting serenely in a thicket of bamboo. You always seem so happy and peaceful, said Monkey. Yes, you could say that, said Happy Panda with a little smile. What do you do to be so happy and peaceful? I walk, I work, I read, I eat, I play, and I rest. I walk, I work, I read, I eat, I play, and I rest too, but... I am not so happy, said Monkey. That seems true, said Happy Panda as he looked at Monkey. So, Monkey, what do you think? What do you think about when you are doing these things? Well, said Monkey, when I walk, I also think about doing chores. When I do chores, I also think about reading. When I read, I also think about eating. When I eat, I also think about playing. When I play, I also think about resting. When I rest, I also think about walking. Ah, said Happy Panda, your monkey mind jumps from one thing to another. 
always to be somewhere other than here, to be something other than what you're doing right now. Well, of course it does, said Monkey. Isn't that what everyone's mind does? Well, said Happy Panda, when I walk, I am just walking. When I work, I am just working. When I read, I am just reading. When I eat, I am just eating. When I play, I am just playing. And when I rest, I am just resting. True happiness, said Happy Panda gently, comes from bringing all of your attention to whatever you're doing right now. There is no need to think about what happened yesterday. Yesterday's gone, over, done. And there's no need to worry about tomorrow. Tomorrow isn't here. But today is all around us. Bringing your mind back to this moment, right here, over and over and over again, is called mindfulness. Oh, I get it, said Monkey. Mind full, like your mind is full of the present, full of right now. And that's definitely how I want to be. And at that very moment, Monkey started to practice mindfulness. How about you? And that was the book, Mindful Monkey, Happy Panda. The story was written by Lauren Aldifer, and the illustrations were made by Carrie Lee McLean. The end. So wasn't that a great story? What part did you like? Really? Yeah, Sensei liked that part too. How about you, Barkley? Well, Sensei, I thought it was really funny when the happy panda told Monkey he had a monkey mind. Well, Monkey is a monkey mind, so of course he has a monkey mind. <laughs> I'm a dog, so I've got a dog mind. So Sensei, you're a Sensei, so you got a Sensei mind. Okay, okay, okay. Well. I know what he means though, right? I mean, some mornings, uh, my monkey mind is just jumping around all over the place until I start chanting or um, sitting meditation. And then I kind of slow down and become calm. Eha, sensei, that's right. My buddy Benji taught me how to sit all quiet like. So like, like this, right? So be like Benji. Yee-haw! Pretty good, huh, Sensei? Wow, you're really good at quiet sitting. Can you do a Buddha face like Kalena? Let's give it a try. Okay, here we go. Okay, kids, everybody out there, put on your Buddha face. Yee-haw! Whoa, you scared me there, Barkley. Okay. Ah, uh, where are we? Where are we on the script? Okay. Can you do a Buddha face like Kalena? Okay. Wow, oh, hey, that's really cool. Okay, hey kids, let's all make our Barkley face, okay? Okay, well, Sensei, I gotta be moseying along now. Um, you know, Lucy told me not, not to talk too much uh, because, because, oops, I gotta roll down. Because our good old buddy, Reverend Tommy, is the guest speaker today for the Adult Dharma Talk. And this time, I'm going to listen when I'm listening, talk when I'm talking, and be good when I'm being good. But not too much. <laughs> 
Okay, you, okay, you little rascal dog. Thank you very much for joining us this morning, Barkley. And thank you, children, for listening to the, the children's Dharma story. So now, go grab, go grab your mommy and daddy and tell them that Reverend Tommy's going to give the adult Dharma talk now. So they got to come back, okay? Very good. Okay, kids, let's say goodbye to Barkley. Bye, Barkley. See you next week. Okay, woo, yeah, ha. See you, kids. Be good, but not too much. Blah. Okay, thank you, Berkeley. Uh, where are we? Sorry, Sensei's monkey mind has taken over.